Hey, Bodybuilding.com. It's Liam McIntyre from Spartacus War of the Damned, here to tell you about the guy that changed my life, changed my training, changed my shape. This is Tyrone Bell. Tell him a little bit about yourself. I am the official Spartacus trainer, and I am the man responsible for what you see here. <laughs> yeah, no, um, Tyrone and I had an interesting little journey, so... Um, we did. Nice. We did. How'd we meet? Uh, it was in a gym, funny enough. Yeah, yeah crazy, yeah. right? <laughs> no, it was... Um, it was an interesting time for me because I just lost all this weight for another film, like 45 pounds. So mm -hmm. um, I was I was in the works for maybe getting this role, and 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 the head of stunts, Al Poppleton, was putting me through this crazy boot camp training, which was soul crushing but amazing, and learning all you know really fundamentally amazing things. But very we, good we had to assess at the start that yeah. your skills were up to scratch for fight scenes. For you know, we had to know you had the endurance yeah. to last the entire season. But unfortunately, that's not the best. You know, as when it comes to packing on muscle. Yeah, so I got real fit, um, yeah. yeah, despite myself. And as soon as you got the role, lot. then, you know, we were throwing the brief that you needed lean muscle mass. You <laughs> needed to be ripped, yeah. which went against all against our uh, boot camp training, and we had well, to step yeah. into another sort of form of training. Yeah, well, uh, Ty's the, the master of hypertrophy training, I, guess, I suppose you'd call it. Or, yeah, so the, um, the hard task master of hypertrophy training. Yeah. <laughs> um, so I was, I don't know, I felt like I was in this... Um, I was in this room and working out that I had to have a trainer for the season and, and Ty's, I can only imagine sort of sitting out there going, well, not me, because he's, it's going to be a big job, I don't know. <laughs> I think we met like once at the end of Gods of the Arena when I was testing or something. You know? Yeah, yeah, and I mean, at the first moment, yeah, I looked at you and I was given the brief and um, yeah, Al I, kind of thought, I was good, I know I'm good. <laughs> But I don't do miracles. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't, you don't argue with Al Poppleton because that, right. that guy's the business. And he's like, Ty, you're the man. And I'm like, Make him into well, this. And I'm sitting there going, well, he's massive, so this is going to work out great. I mean, this guy's built like a brick. Should I just going to say that? Probably not. Um, you know, this guy's massive, so if anyone's going to help me out with this, this guy's good. Um, meanwhile, I'm thinking, well, Ty's probably not as excited as I am. <laughs> like I said, I, we, we, it was a challenge because of the time frame. Mm. Um, not only because we had to get you in peak form before shooting, but we had to, you know, the, we had to be training the entire time throughout the seasons. <laughs> yeah, which is and rough. with the time frames we were given for training, it, you know, the, oh. the workouts not only had to be effective, That'd but. Be quick. They had to be very, very time conscious. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So what we had, the, like, we had shoot days where we'd start at five and then we'd yeah. finish up at, you know, seven, something yeah. like that, seven thirty, yeah. and we'd hit the gym at eight thirty. And yeah, those, those. You know, yeah. those were the days. And right? then, and, and then there was times where it's like, okay, with your schedule, you've got twenty minutes. Yeah, boom. It's like, okay, this yeah. is our only chest session for this week. We got to make twenty minutes work. I was so angry if the chest session was twenty yeah. minutes. <laughs> but that's that's where we developed, and um, yeah. we, we needed to develop the nineteen minute workout um, yeah, yeah. where you had to get hypertrophy uh, results from 19 minutes. Yeah, yeah. And we had to develop that, and hey, it worked. Not only for you, but for other cast members, but you Yeah, know. true, well, it's funny, by the end of it, people were just like, lining up. Like, I started off there, and they're like, oh, you're training with Ty, okay, sure, good, have a good time, I'm, I'm going down to my gym. By the end of uh, War of the Damned, everyone's like, yeah. taking a number, taking a number. That's right, that's right. <laughs> it's funny, yeah. and I was like, stay away from my dude. <laughs> this is my time. Yeah, this, is, this is my yeah. time, you should come here earlier. But um, yeah, early days, that was, uh, that was fun, because I was like, oh, this is going to be great. You know, how hard can it be, right? And um, uh, yeah. Tyrone, <laughs> Tyrone's all about hard. And um, <laughs> then, then I introduced Liam to uh, reality. Yeah, and, and nutrition. Yeah, and I nutrition. Oh, yeah, yeah, I yeah. got uh, nicknamed the carb Nazi for good oh reasons. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah I would count and watch every calorie that went through your mouth. Yeah. <laughs> the amount of times that I'd be like, I'd be at. Um, at the lunch table, and like on Thursdays, they'd sometimes have a dessert watching day. You, and watching stuff. you, Literally, I'd walk past it, and <laughs> this guy would just be staring at me. Like, I'm like, that's, no, that's messed up. You should, I, I gotta get a new trainer. This guy's, he's just, he just, this is gonna be a long season. He would just appear, and I'd have like, I'd have some, I don't know, so anything that, it, I was like, it's just, it's a potato. What's wrong? Yeah, it's like, not tire proof. That's off. Yeah, it's not tire proof. That, that, yeah. Even now, like, it happened, it happened today. I'm like, Spartacus is finished, but he walked past, and I'm like, have I, ha oh, phew, I'm gonna play this wrong. That's all right. Just, you let this slide. This is good. This is good. Just sell it. Yeah. But that, um, that was probably, to be honest, that was 80% of your results, yeah, was totally. what you were eating. Well, it's all diet, right? Absolutely, and especially when your schedule is so full on and then our workouts are so intense for that short period of time, mm. recovery and nutrition was paramount. Yeah, um, recovery, yeah. right? <laughs> yeah, recovery. That's the other thing that I couldn't understand because I just spent so long training with Al Poppleton who probably at the time very rightly was like, more is more, just just work till you can't work anymore. And, it was, mm. and for where I was at, it was a really good mind state to get myself into. Absolutely, uh, it makes you mentally hard. Yeah, 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 it really toughens you up for when you, know, you have to do the work. But Ty's like, all right, 
So if you want to grow some muscle mass, we're going to have to change this. And I'm like, but, but no, 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 I've got this worked out. I know what to do. I, I'm just going to lift more. So like, no, no, dude, you don't know what to more. do. You're going to sleep. <laughs> In fact, that end of some training sessions, you're like, what are you going to do now? I'm like, I'm, I'm, you're going to sleep, aren't you? You're yeah. going to sleep. Yeah. I'm like, yes, yeah, yeah, sir, I'm going to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> so I own you for two seasons. Dude. Yeah, it was great. <laughs> Please, Mr. Ty. And um, yeah, we'd, I'd be in early days, I'd be training, and then I'd be like, oh, that looks like a fun exercise. So I'd start doing some arm yeah, curls. Yeah. And Ty, I was like, what are you doing? What are you doing? You want to just throw this away? You're wasting glycogen, man. No. <laughs> <laughs> um, but uh, so I, I think I eventually came around to it. Of course, Spartacus schedule is hard to get the sleep in, but. Uh, mm -hmm. But yeah, like it's, well, that's that's where supplementation came in. We had to get yeah. our glutamine going, you know, um, make sure your BCAAs were in there, um, because yeah, you were a lot of the time sleep deprived, which mm. was unfortunate because you know you would have made even greater gains if you had more sleep under yeah, your belt, which I mean, I'm excited to see yeah. because you are going to stick with it. Yeah. I'm excited <laughs> see, to see <laughs> where you're going to be. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah, well, me too. Yeah. That's the thing. But that's that's what I mean. Like you've actually changed the way I look at training and changed the way I diet and changed the way I live my life because. You know, I was a computer game nerd, and I'd, I'd, I'd say, I know. Play. I'm sorry, I know. About that. Yeah, he still finds it hard to <laughs> sort of accept. But, um, you know, so I, and it was weird. Like a week ago, I was sitting in a hotel room going, oh, finally, I've got some time to play some games. I'm sitting there with, uh, with a game I was playing, and I was like, this is great fun. I'm looking at the clock going, Oh, I really got a training session in. I've never, Good. I've never had that thought. Good. <laughs> yeah, it's stuck life. with you. It's ingrained yeah, now. No, it's yeah. part of me now. And I, I play. I'm like, oh, I'll just put it off for a little bit. I just couldn't. I couldn't do it. I was like, and for the first time in my life, put the game down, walked into the gym, hit out a quick, you know, 30 minute sesh, and 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 you know, blew blew the chest apart. So it was great. And and I've just never been like that. See, so. I'm proud now. I'm proud. Thank you. you you've no, made me happy. Was, it, but it's a it's a life changing thing. I think that's the most important thing that you got through to me, and I was lucky enough to have you for because you were you were there to like change. Like changed my perspective, and that's the thing, because like anyone can do a diet, anyone can mm -hmm. lift some weights for a week, but but you have to really change the way you think about training, and I think that's what you do absolutely so well, you you, you need it. you need to adapt that lifestyle. Yeah, it's it's, it's not. I mean, hey, you could have blown it. You, we could have got this done. You done it for Spartacus, and yeah. that's it. But now it's ingrained, yeah. and it's it's a lifestyle now. And you are always going to be busy, whether you're on a feature film or another TV mm. series. But you know now how to fit an effective workout, effective training, um, nutrition plan, mm. everything in. Because um, you've adopted that lifestyle. Well, that's the gift, though. I mean, that's the, I mean, that's that's the benefit of having a guy that just isn't isn't very nice to you sometimes. <laughs> well, there was there was moments. We don't need to talk about that in the school. <laughs> I got the nice guy thing going on, yeah, right? Yeah, so yeah, let's yeah, stop sure, that. But that doesn't that doesn't train killer bodies. <laughs> <laughs> no, because no. you got to be hard on yourself too, right? You do, you, you do. You got to be honest, because I'd sit there and I'd, I'd, I'd sit there with a the chocolate cake, going, "You, you, and you know what Ty would say if he were here. You know what he'd say." See, that's good. You're you now talking to your food. Saying. That's you, know, yeah. <laughs> you got a connection. About, I'm, like, I, I'm just looking at all those empty calories, and he's like, "Oh, there's sugars, there's fat. You don't want those. You don't want those." And um, you know, I'm like, "No, no, I'm just gonna put it aside." <laughs> Jeez. But you know, it makes it makes its results. That's right. You know, that's what's, right. Uh, what's, um, I mean, what's your favourite session? Because I think, I think we're on the same page with this. But um, well, what like, oh, well, I just remember when we were doing you know, our 19 minute workouts, because mm. sometimes we were throwing, okay guys, you've got 20 minutes. Mm. So that's where we developed that 19 minute workout hypertrophy for different muscle yeah. groups. Chest was always a challenge. Yeah, um, no, that's, that's my challenge, my, one of my challenges. That's groups. right, but I think the, you know, the, the, the most rewarding was always, always the arms. I mean, it's the beach muscle, but you, you, in 19 <laughs> minutes with that rest period, you used to pump up huge. Well, that and was we used good to, news, wasn't it? Yeah, we used to do that um, before you had promotional shoots and stuff like that yeah, um, as well. We just fill them and you know, it's, it's instantly yeah. rewarding. I know, <laughs> so, I slowly turned into a head case, it was always good for Ty because you know, I'd be like, look, nothing's changing, I can't see anything. And Ty's like, dude, your body's like in a totally different place. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, you look at the before and after, yeah, right. and and the progression shots, oh, and yeah. it's like we can literally see the changes happening month to month. Yeah, but Ty, Ty said early on that you, you, you remember you telling me that you're like, Don't, well, unfortunately, the bad news is you'll never be big enough now. Like you'll always look at yourself and go, well, I could fix that. I yeah, could fix that. I could fix that. And in fact, Todd Lasance, we were doing the same thing, and we were both getting back into training, and he was like. Oh, I don't know. The shoulders like is it, is it big enough? Like, and I'm like, dude, you're massive. You look ridiculous. And uh, and I'd be sitting there going, I don't know. I feel like I feel like I'm not I'm not the same size. Anymore. See, it's it's important to be happy where you're at. Exactly but right. there's always that so once so you're once you're content, then it's it's over. Well, yeah, that you is know? kind so of right? yeah. maintaining is boring. You know, yeah, yeah. always looking for constant improvement. Yeah, is, sort of refining yeah. it. Yeah, just yeah, pushing yourself. just making the quality better. But yeah, I remember you warning me about that, and I'm like, no, I'll be, I, I, you know, in my head, I was like, yeah. you know, I'll, I'll be happy at this way. I'll be happy yeah. there. Yeah. No. <laughs> it doesn't work that 
the way, man. Yeah. But um, yeah, no, I always thought uh, chest, chest was my, my satisfying because I felt it always felt really, really rough in the morning, which which I'd learned to accept as the best way to feel when you were just like, oh, I just can't move properly. So obviously I did a good job. That all <laughs> seriously damaged myself. But no, it was. Um, yeah, and safe training, that was the good thing, because it, I mean, it was so good having a spotter and someone that knew what they were doing, could mm. lift the weight, could tell you how to do it, so you didn't just waste your reps and stuff like that. That's right, that's right. When, like when time is that valuable, mm. every rep counts. Mm. And, and both phases, the up phase and the down phase, mm. you know, you don't, don't cheat, don't bounce, you know, yeah, because yeah, you yeah. only have, in 19 minutes, you have 1,140 seconds. So you literally, every second counts, every Workout rep. Workout and math. Oh, hell? mate, <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> what is it? If you're thinking you're shrinking, what's that rule you told me? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, we'll edit that out. <laughs> <laughs> no, too smart for good. But yeah, totally, man, I know. It's, um, you're, you're up against it, and it's hard to make big gains yep. when you're time, time poor, but... I mean, but it is to, possible, you, yeah. Exactly. That's right. That's right. I know it was only, in, but that's the thing, you know. You got to. It's a. It's a long term game. Because mm-hmm. Like near the end of War of the Damned, I started to go. You know what? I do see what you're seeing. I do see the change. Yeah. You know, I could. It, it had been happening for a long time, but I didn't want to believe it because I was used to being the other guy. And, th- and that's the thing too is other people were seeing it. Um, yeah, you know, yeah, but but you yourself, you see yourself every day, so you don't. Don't see you know, the big change. Yeah. yeah. But it wasn't like you said. It wasn't until the end of the season. It's like you know what. I'm looking all right. Yeah, you, you know, know? You, you saw you like a few covers of magazines. You saw yourself in a few things. It's like, damn, I, you know what? I'm okay. Have yeah. I thanked you for that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man, that was that was that was seriously life changing. But then, you know, it wasn't always good news because for those covers and things like that, you uh, you had you had a new system for me, which was something that was very. Hard well, to you know, we that. we had to peak you, and that was the hard that was the hard thing. Um, you know, during like, like guys who compete, you're going to um, peak a few times during the year, but you know, we'd be dropped on. You have a promotional shoot in a week yeah. it's like and I used to like prepping you like it was a competition oh, yeah. we would drop your carbs out completely then we would carb load you would dehydrate you all that and it was it was hell for you in a short oh, amount of time God. but yeah. you know you look at look at the results look yeah at the well, it worked it's again if I wanted to feel good about myself we'd do that they do an arm exercise that's <laughs> right an arm training you'd be like yeah all right I could do this um which I hold back this all the time but man, those are some of the hardest days I remember because yeah. I'm not I'm I'm new at this, so I've never really flown a lot of business class. But they flew me business class to this photo shoot, so I'm like, oh, all this food, all this <laughs> stuff. Of course, <laughs> Tyrone's decided to put me into like this this massive carb depletion phase because yeah. I had to because I was basically going to walk off a plane into a photo shoot. And so there was free chocolate cake. There was all this amazing food, and like you know, chicken, beef, prawn. What do you want? Like, oh, and I had to bring a box of boiled chicken on the plane and and, um, kumara and egg whites that um, depending on the meal times and I had to tell the the steward I'm like can you just bring this cold chicken out to me at like two hour intervals in this amount exactly please and he's like you you're not serious, obviously. Yeah. I'm like, yeah. yeah. He's like, what about all? We've got all. We've got food. I'm like, yeah. You, you don't have. We can make you chicken. I'm like, you can't make me chicken the way I have to have the chicken. <laughs> and he's like, what? but it's just chicken. I'm like, no, it'll have. Does it have seasoning on it? Yeah. Salt. Yeah. Can't have it. <laughs> See, man, I'm proud. That, know, that, right? That's made me really happy, I'm man. There and I'm just <laughs> munching through this horrible chicken. But exactly, exactly. But you know, it's that. That's that's what you can teach me mm. in the sense that the the Liam from three years ago couldn't have done that at all. Like, I couldn't even think like that. Yeah. You'd do it, I'd do it for two days and be like, oh, that's stupid. Yeah, surely it won't make that much difference. You know, surely these things, but that's, 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 I guess that's the lesson of this whole training exercise that I went on you. All of it does make that much difference if you do it all at the right times and the right that's way. That's right, that's you know, right. So if it all has to work together. You can't do one part, you know? The, know. the training and nutrition all works together, well, and the rest. Yeah, this know, is so. like, well, yeah, rest of yeah. course, which again, I was still, even by the end of the season, I'm like, all right. I know, I know, I still reckon that's gonna be the one that you're gonna, <laughs> yeah. we're gonna have disagreements on. Yeah, it's okay. okay, well, no, I do agree with you. I just, you know, I just, I get lazy about it. Yeah, you're stubborn too. the right kind of lazy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> stubborn, yeah, yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> but, you know, it pushes you through. But yeah, I remember he was like, too many people will give you outs. Like, too many other trainers that I've had in the past give you like a little wiggle room. Tyrone. A little wiggle, wiggle room. room, okay. You know, so I was like, he's like, well, you can chuck a little, you know, like other trainers might be like, chuck a little bit of salt on there. Or, you know, look, have a bit of this, have a bit of that. And um, I was like, oh, cool. Well, so, you know, I, I can sort of, you know, get a little, put a little sauce on there or something like that. But when it was, especially when it was coming down to cutting, mm. you know, you were like, exactly this much many milligrams of salt exactly this many uh, grams of protein if you get that wrong by an ounce you've ruined the whole thing everything i'm like well, that can't be possible everything, <laughs> everything 
Well, that, that's, that's what we were working with, though. I mean, um, every, you know, everyday normal people, you know, day to day, they, they can't afford that wiggle room. Yeah, okay? yeah, I, yeah, but yeah, you were you put in front of the world. You know, you were, uh, you were meant to lead a rebellion. You're a sex symbol. You know, you were meant to be this warrior. You know, so there was no room that the milligram could be out. You I know, know well, so. yeah, that's, that's part of it. You know, and I think, you know, there's a lesson in that for, for everyone that's like training. And for me now, like, because I, I know that if I'm you know, not having to be that guy on camera every day, I've got a little more wiggle room, but I only know that because I didn't have the wiggle room and I can start, yeah, you know, I yeah. learn my body a little more from that process, but it's been, it's been a hell of a journey, man. It's, mm. um, it's been exciting, but. And it's not over yet, mate. Well, no, sort of just It's life right? now, yeah. 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 Well, that's the thing, you know, I, like the hard part for me every day was looking at you training huge weights that I was always trying to like match, even though I had this not experienced body. You know, you'd be lifting these huge, like, you know, you'd be doing three plates and stuff. But that's, that's, that's great as well, though, is like, um, you know, normal people as well, you have that goal. Somebody, you know, you follow, might not be your training partner, but you watch training videos of these guys, and, you know, that's what I want to be. That's what I want to be lifting mm. and stuff yeah, like totally. that. So, but, you, you know, you had that in your corner mm. like, every mm. day, which obviously no, helps. Yeah. yeah, no, but the, so this guy was just massive, and I had to look at that every day, which is kind of like the psychosis. Like, I was like, oh, why is Tyrone so big? But, um, you know, I guess that's, that's, keeping it up for a long period of time. That's you know, right, so that's, that that's right, it that's, all comes, the long-term yeah. goal. Yeah. So, you know, like, so many What I made you do was what I was doing as well. Exactly, which so. was amazing. And, you know, and, and so, like, long-term is how you got to start setting your mind up. So many people are out short-term diets, short-term yeah. training cycles, short-term yeah. this, whereas this stuff that you do is all about, you know, really changing your life, which is what I got. Definitely. So. I mean, you can get fast results if you do everything to the gram, you mm. know, yeah. uh, to the pound um, you, and to the second. You yeah. can get fast results, but then, like you said, it becomes a lifestyle and that's yeah. where you start making your great gains. That's the change. Is yeah, once well, it's yeah, in early there. days it took a while, but it did. as we went it in, did. Yeah. it got faster and faster and mm -hmm. really started to, to take hold and when it, it got ingrained, it was, yeah, man, look, I'm excited for you to be able to do like this workout with some of these people for bodybuilding. Oh, I can't wait to show. Yeah, you know, I mean, because these are the actual workouts that I made you do, yeah, you know, and I do personally as well. Yeah. So to be able to show everybody what we did, you know, yeah. um, so course. it's great um, for people who are push for time massively. Yeah, you yeah know? totally. So. And it's achievable, and it, it and it just it takes discipline, but it's it's a, a realistic life change. Yeah, I think that's what I mean, that's what you brought me, and I appreciate that so much. So you're welcome. Go out and knock them dead, man. Thanks, we'll bro. do.